God is opening your eyes to take your job, your business, take your business, you've been searching for it. Take what you've been crying for, you've been searching for it. God is honoring you. I'm not dying there. I'm not dying in poverty. I'm not dying in lack. I'm not dying in stripes. I'm reaching my destiny. There's a place I'm seeing where God is taking me. Can I prophesy somewhere? You are going somewhere. Are you seeing a place where other people cannot see? It's where God is taking you. Can we read Romans 8? By Romans 8. Are you there? Today you'll be delivered. Uh, now we'll read from verse 22. Verse 22. Are you happy to be here? Amen. Let us read Romans 8, verse 22. Romans 8, 22. And we'll read going down. For we know that the whole creation grooneth and travels in pain together until now. And it, uh, not only they, but ourselves also, which have the first fruits of the Spirit, even we ourselves grown within ourselves, waiting for the adoption to wit the redemption of our body. 24 say, we, for we are saved by hope. But hope that is seen is not hope. For what a man seeth, why doth he yet hope for? But if we hope for what that we see not, then do we with patience wait for it. Amen. Can you see the verse there? Amen. Can you just read 26 it's aloud in your Bible? Arab 26. So let's pray. Father, thank you for your word in Jesus' name. Amen. So the verse that we're reading is this one for we know that the whole creation groaneth and travelleth in pain together until now. Say, Say until now. There is uh, something I want us to talk that we found that many we don't know how far we are supposed to go or any boundary. If you can check here, you realize that the, the, revelations, the revelations about our boundaries are not yet clear until I now. Saw you, you, you cannot understand where you are supposed to go, how far you can go until, until the revelation that God can give you. Yeah, the Bible says Bible. the hope Could has been captured it's where? because of the bondage. And therefore, we are subject for vanity. To extend that even those who are filled with the Spirit, they, they are just groaning in the Spirit, but not understanding that there is liberty. The Bible shows that there is liberty. The creature itself also shall be delivered. That's what I say, you must be delivered. Listen to this. Unless you are delivered, you are subject for vanity. 
you are bound to have hopes that will never come to pass. And then you will just groan and groan until now. Waiting for the sons of God to be revealed. There is liberty. That was my friend. We have liberty that God has given us. So we'll talk about it. Your liberty in the Lord. Just write your my liberty in the Lord. Liberty means unrestricted unbounded unbounded unrestricted so when you are delivered there is no restrictions there is no bondage that can bound you in other words, we are supposed to be thinking not, not literally but diversely. In a way of understanding that nothing can stop us. I don't know if you are hearing me. The Bible says we have been groaning until now. Praying, fasting, asking God so that we reach a life of liberty in the Lord. Are you hearing me? We need to reach a life where we understand our liberty in the Lord. Liberty means whatever you can do. You can do without restrictions. You can do without being bound. You do it with freedom. You understand that nothing can touch you. You, you, you become untouchable. Unstoppable. Unblockable. We need Christians who are untouchable. That's what I'm afraid. I want to be untouchable. I want to be accessible. But untouchable. Amen. You cannot produce and, and end up giving the difference. Or you can't give what you cannot produce. Your ability of producing, I mean, it's portrayed by what you are giving. If you can read that scripture, it shows that Christians will portray that whatever they are showing is what they are living from the world. The moment is the Bible says you are blessed with all spiritual blessing, we will see it on you. The moment the Bible says God will supply all your needs, we must see that on you. Your liberty must define you that you are a son of the living God. I don't know if you are hearing me. That's what I say, my friend. When you look at me from today, you will know that I am serving the living God. I am serving the living God. I don't know if you are hearing me. The moment you reach that level where you are going is closer. There are some people here outside they are poor but inside they are rich. You are the one I'm talking about. The creation has been waiting for you. From today you will manifest. Say from today I will manifest. The money outside of you, the hope that is in you must not be bound by any bondage or stopped by any restriction. We have been waiting for you. Something must come out today. We must see something come out. I don't know if you are hearing me. Your come has come out. Your reach is what? Hey, your liberty must be visible. You know why? Because they can talk against you. But they can't take what is inside you. 
There is leadership in you. There is success in you. There is money in you. We have been waiting for you. We have been, we have been waiting for you. It is your time to manifest. I say you are the one that God is revealing. God is revealing you. 